ściśle związana właśnie z Suchową. Beaten, mutilated and thrown into the Vistula River while still alive, all for speaking truth. This is what happened to Polish blessed father Jerzy Popielusko by the communist secret police in 1984, 35 years ago. Conference and exhibit in Rome is celebrating his life and pushing for his canonization after he was beatified nearly 10 years ago. The Polish ambassador to the Holy See said for Poles, his death is a symbol of communism. Who was really a hero. He didn't hate anyone. He was coming with love even to those who persecuted him. And that's why they've tortured him and maybe he was still alive when they threw him into the Vistula River. Can you imagine? It was a tragedy for us. It was a personal tragedy for me because I knew him personally. The ambassador says they weren't extremely close, but due to the faithful Catholics in Poland, his name was very well known. We are not close. I, I, I can't say that we are friends or, or, or something like that. He was a very shy, very normal priest. But when he was talking, he was talking the truth, not being afraid of, of the communist regime. The Polish priest family was also at the opening of the exhibit, including his brother, sister-in-law and nephew, pictured in yellow on the wall. Now I know there was every, every time, every minute with Father Jerzy was important, but then there was very just normal uh, meetings with, with, with uncle. I was 14 years old when he was killed, so I remember this, this time very well. And I spent lots of time, I'm sorry, I spent lots of time with, uh, with my, in my grandparents' house, in you know, a couple, Father Jerzy was born. And uh, then there's a place where Fadiyaj came for vacation for, to see the, the parents, to see the family. Now they're waiting for him to be canonized after a miracle was confirmed in France at the cause of his intercession. Yet it's obvious the Vatican's working on it, since Pope Francis even thanked the Polish here in Rome for the exhibit for keeping alive the martyr's legacy. Vi ringrazio per il mantenimento della memoria di questo celante sacerdote e martire che barbaramente assassinato dai servizi comunisti ha dato la vita per l'amore di Cristo e della Chiesa e degli uomini, soprattutto quelli privati della libertà e della dignità. The priest's memory is very much alive in Poland and throughout Europe, as many contribute his death and personal sacrifice to another reason for the eventual collapse of communism.